China's plants have contributed a lot to the world. We've exported up to thousands, including some from our botanical gardens. We've worked very closely with other countries in terms of research. For example, we had a dawn redwood in one of our gardens, and we discovered it was still quite a global sensation. The dawn redwood is, in fact, a very ancient plant. It existed in the Jurassic period of dinosaurs. The species was once widespread, then became extinct because of the Ice Age. In the 1940s, a new pair was discovered in Hubei, China, hence its reputation as a living fossil plant. After this discovery, many countries gave it a lot of attention, and so did we. We started to collect seeds, then cultivated and bred them in the botanical garden. Let's take a look at its traits. You can see that its leaves are arranged in the shape of a feather. It's a deciduous species. In the autumn, its leaves will fall off with some twigs. The middle branch will remain, so it grows like this every year. Another trait of the Don Redwood is that it occupies a special place in the system between the Taxodiaceae in Cruprasaceae families. Due to its rediscovery, as well as other species, the two families have merged into one, the Cruprasaceae. Look at the fruit. This is the cone of a female flower. But if you look a bit up, you can see that the leaves of the upper branch are different. Up there, they're male flowers. So the dawn redwood is a monoecious plant. That is, flowers of both sexes are born on a single plant. The dawn redwood is a species that has been successfully preserved by our predecessors. It has been introduced to more than 50 countries and regions in the world. It is a classic case of rare and endangered plant conservation.